So here's a good question that we received from an Articulate user. We've got all these cool downloads at eLearning Heroes, and the one that we're looking at right here is a whole bunch of hand-drawn graphics that Tom made. And a course designer was asking me if there's a way to easily change these to a different color right within PowerPoint. Like let's just say if we switch out to PowerPoint here, let's just say we're working with maybe these circles or check marks or arrows and we want to change the arrow to a different color. And this one right here I've actually already changed to green and I'll show you how you can do that. Up here on the Format tab once you've selected an image, you can come over to this Colors drop down and if you select that, you'll see a whole bunch of different options and especially this last row right here is going to give you some very different color variations than you know just the standard shades of what you're already working with. So like if I wanted to maybe change this to blue, very easy to do that. Or if I wanted to change it to purple, I can just switch it right out to purple. And um, one of the things that sometimes people ask is, you know, that's pretty cool, but what happens if the color that I need isn't actually shown here in this list? Then what do I do? Well, that's okay because you can change what's available here. These colors all come from your uh, design theme because see when I hover over these options, I'm getting this little tool tip. Like this one says, you know, accent color six right here, and this one's accent color five and so on. Those are all names that are coming from my design theme and that design theme is customizable. So let's see how we can customize that with the colors that we want. If you come up here to the design tab, you'll find this option over here called colors and this is where you can control all of those theme colors and you'll see probably a whole bunch of you know built-in theme colors and this might be all that you see if you've never um, played around with the color themes in PowerPoint. Um, these design themes cannot be changed because they're built in, but which, watch what you can do. If you come down to the bottom, you can choose create new theme colors, and that's going to open up this window where you can pick any colors that you want. So let's go ahead and change that one that we saw earlier, this one called Accent 6, which is orange. Um, we'll go ahead and just change that to something very different. Let's go ahead and choose pink since that'll be really noticeable. And just so you know, you can change the color to one of the ones that are shown here. But if you need to change the color to something super specific, like if you've got some corporate colors that you, you know, want to specify the exact color value, you can do that too. You just choose more colors down here at the bottom and then you get this window where you can enter, you know, the RGB values or you can choose up here from the color palette. We won't worry about that right now. This pink one is going to work just fine. Um, and then from here, once you've made the changes that you want to make, you can name your color theme if you want. It'll give it a default name, but um, you can name it something else if you want. And then you can go ahead and click Save. And then once you've done that, you can select your object again, come up to the Format tab, and then use the Color drop-down to apply the color that you just changed. So there's our pink color. It's no longer orange. You can see that it's, uh, you know, it's that pink color that we were working with when we were editing the color theme. Now, if you change your mind, you can always come back up here to the Format tab and there's this option called Reset Picture. If you click on that, that's going to trash any changes that you made. So, you know, if you really mess up the colors and you want to go back to what it was when you first inserted the picture, you can always do that and then that'll allow you to start over if you need to.